Hi there, and greetings from Ical right on Tulum's pristine white sand beach. Um, coffee's arriving over there in about 15 minutes. Um, it's great to be back here. Rita members who've bought in Samsara will know all about this place because this is where the owner's beach club in Samsara is going to be. And um, I checked out construction progress at Samsara yesterday, absolutely blown away by the quality. I'm very excited. Um, it's been uh, an exciting and energizing and intense 10 days on the road. Um, but first, we had a big deal since I left, since I hit the road. Our members only True Beachfront Panama opportunity opened on Thursday. Congratulations if you got in. Um, True Beachfront, walk out your front door, past the pool, toes in the sand, just like I've got here. That's a truly rare thing, let alone so close to a major international city like Panama City, a major international city that's going to be a true beneficiary in the next years and in the next decades from its strategic position, how it's positioned geographically and how it's positioned itself economically to suck in multinational HQs from right across the region. So congratulations if, if, if you got in. And, you know, the, the, the role or the value of True Beachfront just really, really, really rang through with me again this past week in the Dominican Republic. So I've spent the last week primarily in Punta Cana, Cap Cana and Las Terrenas. And even as our members only deal was was opening i was visiting the last beachfront site in punta cana that's available for development and the get in there uh, on the remaining inventory is in the region of nine hundred thousand dollars so you know even at that price beachfront like that um seems a, a, a relatively good buy of course nothing like the buy that our our members only deal was um, so it was my first trip to the Dominican Republic in quite a long time, um, probably uh, probably eight years. Um, I focused on Punta Cana, Cap Cana, and Las Terrenas, and all of this is part of our broader Project Prosper 2 initiative and that is how do we react, how do we profit, how do we continue to find and invest in the level of deals that we've got in on over the past three years in this era of scarcity and uncertainty. So Project Prosper 2 is all about those two things. How we profit in this era where best-in-class real estate is highly scarce, but also this era of uncertainty in terms of inflation, interest rates, ge geopolitical. So it's a very, very interesting time. Um, key takeaways from the Dominican Republic. Broadly speaking, I was highly impressed and extremely excited about Cap Cana and Las Terrenas and certain parts of the, 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 the Punta Cana area. So first of all, Cap Cana is a major master planned resort community, twice the size of Manhattan is their pitch, I think about 30,000 acres, and it is just jam-packed with, with luxury, jam-packed with luxury amenities, jam-packed with the signature golf course, some of the most pristine white sand beaches, turquoise Caribbean waters I've, I've ever seen, luxury hotels, sport fishing, marina, in many ways, it kind of just reminded me as a, of a Caribbean version of Cabo. It's almost like take everything you've got in Cabo, um, put it, squeeze it all together and put it on like the, the maybe the nicest stretch of, of flat Caribbean waters I've, I've, I've ever seen. So, um, the right deal there would certainly work for us. This is a place of, you know, multi, multi-million dollar homes and condos. There is an area 
of the community though that I've been speaking with one of the country's major developers about the possibility of a of a RITA member only deal there so watch this space in terms of that um, then Las Terrenas um, Las Terrenas for very many years was one of just my favorite places to to visit and to hang out it's got busier um, it's grown up a bit but it's still got those really really wonderful characteristics of a, a long curve of of beachfront backed by boutique hotels bars restaurants and what you've got is these really dramatic hills that 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 rise up rise up from the sea so um looking absolutely beautiful really strong really strong rental yields there from 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 what i could gather a shortage of nice rentals europeans coming in in big numbers right across the the dior i found the kind of the infrastructure um and access to be very kind of neat and tidy there's lots of talks of more and improved air access so the future bodes very well for 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 tourism so again watch this space with the for arita members only deal in in las terrenas you know i've got a a, a few balls in the air but you know this is an area that's particularly challenging in terms of environmental regulations and due diligence and it's very difficult to get the the type of property at scale that we'd that we'd want for a RITA members only deal so you know so in terms of the Dominican Republic stay tuned for my for, for my full reports um, I'm excited with the right deal it's a place that could could fit our Rita 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 deal criteria but of course that the deal needs to be right the developer needs to be right the project needs to be right the the place needs to be right and the terms for us needs to be right so um I'm on that um you're on the other side providing um providing our group buying power and again you know that just delivered so much in terms of extra special pricing again last week for 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 members because it's it's only because of you and our group buying power that we get to offer pricing like we had last week in in Panama and um, here back in back in Tulum I flew into Cancun yesterday morning that's 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 Saturday um, came straight to Tulum to check in on um, a number of projects and also potential projects again just every time I'm I'm blown away just it's four months since I've been here and even in that time I've just seen so many improvements the the the, the there's been a significant upgrade um, from the the Coba sewer the, the the beach road the main road that goes down to the beach that's been light flanked and lined with new pedestrian and, and and bike access it's all been tidied up it was a bit of a mess there for a while with construction it's looking great new projects along that road are now open with bars and restaurants twice we out along that street it's taking on a really really kind of funky and classy boulevard vibe and um, and Tulum just is a juggernaut it's just a machine of amazing food that whole beach vibe perfect weather um, and it's it's just continuing to to to, to, to go to, to go from strength to strength so pricing is just way up on when we had our last members only deal so our last major members only deal here was samsara um you know comp pricing like for like is up probably certainly comfortably in the region of maybe 55 or 50 57 percent on our on our rita pricing 
that's stellar. So congratulations if you got in there or in our Edena or in our Natal or our Grand Tulum um, opportunity. All those values are, are, just, are just through the roof. Um, my focus now is, is Project Prosper 2 and how, what's the angle for us now? How can we profit from, from Tulum today? And aside from Tulum, where are the other places? Where is the, where's the next Tulum? Where is the place that we can, we can, we can get in, we can get in on the ground floor? Um, so Tulum and some of our more, d more developed markets like Tulum and Lagos and Playa del Carmen, prices there have risen significantly. So again, that's great news if you got in. Um, it's making figuring out the next wave of, 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 of Rita deals more, more challenging. But with the, with the right land in play, it, it can be done. You know, still, if you're a developer who bought land a, a long time ago, has been sitting on land and recognizes the value of our fast sales, we can still make the numbers work to, to bring a deal to, to RETA members at that level of stellar member-only member -only pricing. And um, then, yeah, just bringing it back to, to, to Project Prosper 2, our mission there is to, again, figure out how we can, how we can profit in this era of scarcity and, and uncertainty. So it's all about boots on the ground, finding the next places, but then also figuring out our angle to make deals in places like this, places like Tulum, where our group buying power has that extra value now. Because remember, part of this macro environment is higher interest rates and also an uncertainty about what the, what the next year will hold in terms of the global economy and the economy in the States. And that's making developers nervous. And when developers are nervous, I have more leverage thanks to our group buying power. So all told, um, congratulations if you got in on Panama, true beachfront, um, you know, they ain't making any more of that, let alone so close to a, to a, to a, a vibrant international city like Panama. And um, stay tuned for my reports from the road. I'm pretty much constantly on the road now until the middle of April when I'm going to settle down on Portugal's Algarve for a vacation. So between now and then, it's boots on the ground, Project Prosper 2, in search of the best opportunities to profit in this era of scarcity and uncertainty.